fast train, life's going straining just to catch a glance Raining in everything I left behind to catch a glimpse of moment Picture stars and trees and clear blue sky before they pass Forgotten treasures exit the corner of my eye Life's just the same game of Suntan, sunscreen, strawberry, ice cream, midsummer's daydream, sipping in between long days, warm nights, gliding like light kites, sapphire, clear skies, whipped cream, cherry pies. Ooh, every year, right around June 21st. Yeah. how I purchased my iPad Air 4 for only 9,000 pesos for three months amounting to a total of 27,000 pesos. A little backstory, I got my iPhone 13, the phone that I am using right now for filming, uh, two months ago sa Power Mac and I got it for about 51,000 pesos. I did a little bit of canvassing sa IG shops, sa Green Hills and they sell it for about 45 thousand pesos lang. And these are the prices nung nagpunta ko sa Power Mac. The retail price is about 36,000 pesos but I got my unit for only 27,000 pesos. So nakasave ako roughly around 10,000 pesos. So now I'm going to share with you kung anong shop yung pinagbilhan ko. It is called Kim Store PA. And by the way, I didn't directly order sa Kim Store. Although yung nakausap ko is from Kim Store talaga siya. Um, yung pinag-orderan ko is the Atome app. So, ganito yung itsura ng Atome app. Ganyan siya. It, it has different stores and the only thing that you need para makapag-log in or para makapag-sign up ka dito sa app na to is a credit card or a debit card. Medyo familiar din talaga ako sa Kim Store kasi nga, very eligible siya and nakikita ko din siya sa YouTube, sa Instagram. So, I checked for the products and they have here... Ayan, iPhone 13, iPhone 11, meron din silang mga MacBook Air. And what you have to do is you just have to search for iPad. And sobrang dami mong pagpipilian. They have iPad Mini 6, they have the iPad Air for 2020, and madami din silang mga ino-offer na promo. And may ino-offer din silang Apple iPad Air 5 na may kasamang Apple Pencil na 2nd gen. Mind you, 2nd gen, around 8,000 pesos siguro to. And it's only for 38,290 pesos. And with the Atome app, mababayaran mo siya for only 12,763 pesos for 3 months. So basically, may iPad Air ka na, may 2nd gen ka pa na Apple Pencil. This is actually my first choice. Kaso, the only available color they have is color blue and being the ma arte person that I claim to be, I could never buy a blue iPad. So I just went for the iPod, uh, for the iPad Air 4. And ayan, sobrang dami nilang pagpipilian. So what's good about this Atome app is they accept 
credit card or debit card and you don't have minimum available balance na meron yung credit card mo or yung debit card mo. All you need to have is a credit card or a debit card. As to installments ng 3 months with the Atome app, 0% interest, this is my favorite part, 0% interest, no minimum available balance, and 200 pesos on your first purchase. After you order via Atome app or Kim store, ipipick up mo siya or pwede mo siyang ipadeliver sa inyo. Yung delivery kasi since taga New Valley, Laguna ko, um, 3 to 5 working days or business days, I believe. So what happened is the same day I ordered via the Atome app, nakuha ko din siya kaagad. Pinick up namin siya sa Technopop Greenbelt. So ayun. So that's basically the complete transaction of how I got my iPad Air 4 for only 27,000 pesos with 3 months installment of 9,000 pesos only. And the reason why I got this is because I think that this is the most affordable unit that I could get na magagamit ko for school or content creating and stuff like that. It's just so convenient kasi you can just download PDF files of your books and then pwedeng dito ka na magbasa. You can take notes here and go paperless especially that I am taking a pre-med course. I am currently a third year nursing college student and madami kaming tinitake down notes, madami kaming binabasa. So if you are also a student student and nagahanap ka ng unit or gadget ka. So, feeling mo sobrang bigat sa bulsa, go on Kimstore PH website and then mag-canvas kayo kasi feeling ko yun talaga yung pinaka-eligible and pinaka-trusted na brand. In this part of this video, I'm going to do a quick iPad tour because I was able to set it up last night. This is what my wallpaper looks like. So, Pinterest ko lang to nakuha. You guys wanna see my mood board of my widgets, you guys can check it out on my Pinterest account. I'll be putting the link below. But yeah, for the first slide, ito lang siya. Very faint. And dito may mga widgets ako na hindi ko pa na organize. I have here um, photos, calendar, weather, and then my screen time. So ito yung screen time ko. Um, basically, I spend most of my time with Notion, YouTube, and CapCut. Here I have location, my battery percentage. And then dito sa first side, this is my favorite part. So I organized ko talaga siya last night. But yeah, I have here a widget that says protect your energy. I did this with Widget Smith, by the way. And then I have here on my calendar. Today is Monday, September 5, 11.50 a.m. And then I have here Spotify. If you guys want to follow me on Spotify, I will be putting my link below. My username is Juliana Villaparte. And then here I have my reminders app. Basically, and dito yung mga kailangan ko i-post for the deals. I have my notions. And then I have here a widget of Lisa Manoban. And then... Um, another widget that says don't worry be happy. So lahat yan nasa Pinterest mood board ko. And then here I have my apps. I have CapCut, Pinterest, Widget Smith, Canva, Netflix, YouTube, Notion. This is my current favorite app. I am super glad na nag-download ako ng Notion. It has made my life so much easier and so much organized. Good notes. And I have Spotify, Tweak. Itong Tweak para siyang um calendar. Planner siya. So, ayan. By tomorrow, I have a diagnostic exam. And then, by September 7, mayroong class election. And Quizlet, if you are a nursing student, you would know how Quizlet and Nurse Lab is super important. Diyan ako usually nag-review. And then, I have Messenger Timetable. Itong timetable, di ko pa ito na-open. So, nasa intro pa lang tayo. And then, I have this folder mga unnecessary apps for me and then utilities. And then I have here this app. Dinownload ko lang to kagabi pero apparently it's paid so baka umorder na lang din ako na to sa Instagram. And then I have here my Atome app. So yun yung shinare ko sa inyo kanina. So yun, yun, ang, yun pa lang naman yung laman ng um, iPad ko. Hindi ko pa siya na-organize as you can see yung apps kalat-kalat pa. But I will be doing a more thorough iPad tour or like how I take down notes on my iPad. So yeah, that's all for today's video. I hope you guys got something good from this. Click the subscribe button.